Hi friends, Sparklet here. Welcome to my latest video. Today I invite you to join us on a fascinating encounter with wild birds at San Diego Safari Park. <laughs> Hi friends, Sparklet here. Today we are in Safari Wild Animal Park. San Diego Safari Park is one of the world's largest zoos, housing over three and a half thousand animals of 400 species. Founded in 1972, the park offers visitors a unique opportunity to observe animals in the wild in the large space. <laughs> A variety of animals can be seen at San Diego Safari Park, including gorillas, monkeys, snakes, crocodiles, and many more. In this video, I focus on the diverse bird species found at the park, from peacocks and flamingos to storks and more. <laughs> With over 10,000 bird species on the planet, each with its unique look and behavior, we were amazed by the beauty and diversity of the birds at San Diego Safari Park. <laughs> And yeah, enjoy the time, you see you. I want to watch it. Is this true? Oh, yeah. Is it the right one walking? that injured and orphaned animals are taken in, ensuring their survival, and the park has one of the world's largest veterinary clinics. The park's vast territory allowed us to explore different areas where we observed these birds in their natural habitats.
the territory of the park is huge and today we were able to see only a small part of it. Why you touch it? San Diego Safari Park is a must-visit destination for anyone who loves animals and nature. Should I do a backflip? What was that bag? Anyone who loves animals and nature should visit this park to enjoy the beauties of the animal world and nature. Unlike a zoo, the park animals roam freely in wild open enclosures giving visitors a unique experience. Admission to the park costs around $100 per person per day. But in my video, you get free admission. Oh, look at that! Nest! Look at that! It poops on you. No. <laughs> Some confuse zoo and safari park. Safari park is not a zoo. San Diego Safari Park is located in the city of Escondido and the zoo is in the city of San Diego. The Safari Park keeps animals in wild open enclosures in which wild animals roam freely. The Safari Park has a special bus that allows visitors to travel around the park and observe the animals from a distance. Of the two zoos in San Diego, I like Safari Park the most. I like the Safari Park primarily because of their large animal pens and their beautiful landscapes. We also explored the park's playing grounds, where children can relax and have fun after exploring the animals. One of the popular playgrounds is Discovery Playground, which includes swings, slides and climbing frames. It's located next to the children's zoo, where children can watch various animals, including goats, sheep and ponies. In my next video, we will take a tram ride through the park to see even more animals and enjoy the scenery. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more exciting travel videos. Join me in exploring the world and enjoying life. Your Sparklet.